Is this the first show of a week on, week off? Yeah. Week? So where are you coming from? Uh, San Francisco. Yeah. Actually, I well, yesterday I left Hawaii to yeah. fly to San Francisco. And then overnight in San Francisco. And then we, uh, we left San Francisco at, at 9.30 this morning to fly out here. Well, no wonder you're feeling sick. How many time zones is that? Uh, too many to, to, to bother counting, pretty much. Um, but you know, I've, I've been sick since about Friday. But, you know, I'm fine. You know, as long as I can stand up, I can do the show is my motto. You know, if I'm too sick to stand up, then forget about it. But, you know, I seem to be handling it. Does the week on, week off thing work with you guys? Totally, because, you know, we, ha- we all have kids. And we're able to like maintain a relationship with our families, while still go out and play, you know, five shows a week, and it all makes us really, really, you know, really, really happy and balanced. It balances the professional musician part with, you know, just trying to be family men and parents, and you know, it's taken us a little bit longer longer to cover all the stops we need. To uh, to uh, uh, to take uh, uh, you know what I mean by that is it takes us longer to to hit all the places we need to uh, to to tour around the world, but at the end of the day, it's worth it because we have our sanity intact. Because what drives us crazy is separation from our families. We figured out after twenty five years of doing this, <laughs> um, and so this kind of, this is an attempt to strike a balance, and so far it's working. It's working out really well, actually. You've got a Rock and Roll Hall of Fame event on Friday. Yes. What's, that's interesting because it used to be for years. It was in the Waldorf Hotel, mm-hmm. and it was a closed-door event, and all the people you know who normally shouldn't be wearing tuxedos wore tuxedos in mm-hmm. this event. Mm-hmm. And then there was some sort of massive jam at the end after everybody got inducted. This time, this year, it's different because it's a massive two-night thing mm-hmm. at Madison Square Garden. What, mm-hmm. What's your role in this one? Well, this, the thing that's coming up, it, it, it's a benefit for the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. It's not the actual in, induction thing induction ceremony it's more of a benefit and uh you know the the people behind the rock and roll hall of fame were so impressed by our our, our uh, induction and our attitude toward the induction and and all the good positive things we had to say about the rock and roll hall of fame that they actually asked us back to to uh, participate in this benefit and i'm all for it you know i'm i'm, I'm all for it because uh I'm a big supporter of the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame and keeping the memory of of rock and roll through the years alive and and uh, you know I, I, being acknowledged by the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame means a lot to me. So when they asked us to do this, we said, "Oh yeah, absolutely." And so what exactly what we're going to do is it's going it's going to span um the uh the the uh, the history of rock and roll. And what it's attempting to do, this benefit, is attempting to um, uh, 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 um, put together uh, current artists with uh, Rock and Roll Hall of Fame uh, uh, inductees uh, from past years. And, uh, and so there's, a lo- uh, there's these collaborations that are going to uh, be, be working. And um, what, what that is is... Um, we're going to be playing with, with uh, with Ray Davies. We're going to be playing. You really got me with him. We're going to be playing with Lou Reed. We're going to be playing a Lou Reed song, and then we're going to be playing with Ozzy. We're going to be playing a Black Sabbath song, and uh, it should be a lot of fun. It's a two day thing. On our day, it's uh, uh, Aretha Franklin, Jeff Beck, us, and you too. So it's going to be a pretty interesting show altogether, as far as. Uh, you know the audience is is concerned. It's going to be a big uh, mashup of of uh, of talent. 